Hey everybody, Keith K here, and we are back in the South Pacific for another Stranded Deep video. This is the third in our series of boss fights. So we fought the Meg, we fought the giant eel, and now we need to go find the giant squid. Um, we've looked at the map before, and uh, based on where we are right now, we just need to head off to the west a little bit, and maybe a little bit northwest. Um, so we're gonna head out into the water and do that now. Uh, before we go, I did just want to remind you the spear gun arrows that we're using as our primary weapon are really cheap. They're just a lashing and a stick. So we've really stockpiled uh, those. I've been spending a little bit of time just um, gathering fibrous leaves to make lashings and gathering a bunch of wood. Um, we're going to go go in with two full stacks of 24, so 48 total spear gun arrows, uh, which should give us more than enough. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and do like I've always done, and I'm going to hotkey these, um, and then we will uh, locate Luska the Great. Uh, I understand it should be a buoy of some sort out in the water. Once we find that, we will come back, and, I'll, and we'll take it from there. All right, I think we see the buoy off in the distance here. Um, it, it's pretty small from far away, but you, can, you should be able to make it out. Yeah, that's definitely a buoy. So we're headed in. I've hot keyed our spear gun, uh, as I said, the bandages and the refined spear, so I can quickly shift between those. Um, I think I'm just going to pull straight up to the buoy. All right, now before we get into the actual fight with Luska, I did want to make sure you guys knew that uh, I did not get through this in one take. This was a pretty hard uh, boss to fight. Um, I'd love to hear. Uh, any comments or tips on what uh, I may have missed uh, in terms of how best to fight this guy but he killed me underwater and he killed me uh, over water if you will so let's see the final take all right we're almost at the buoy I'm gonna try to get right up on top of it if I can so that I could potentially run between the buoy and the raft here Although I don't know that that's going to do me a lot of good, but we'll see. Oh, and we fell through. All right, here we go. Oh boy, and that is a heck of a tentacle pull. Got to try to avoid that. And I'm bleeding. So when we're in here, I don't know if we could stab him. Where is our boat? Oh, we are not close. All right, let's get a bandage. Let's get a shot in. Shots in. It's not it do good in the water. We're bleeding again. Okay, and my hotkeys seem to stop working, or at least for the bandage. There's no escape in that. Dang it. I am missing way too much. I'm in pretty bad shape here. Let's get another bandage on. Let's try to get away from him this time. Oh. And those tentacles are something awful. I'm 
Not bleeding, that's good. Close. Getting close, folks. Stay away from those tentacles. And no luck. Come on. Alright, let's get the bleeding taken care of. Up on the raft. Whoa. Uh, shoot. Uh, come on. Come on. Alright, we just made it. Let's uh, get some air here. So we got the trophy and the aircraft propeller part. We are bleeding, so we need to take care of that right away because, yeah, of course he disappears. That was definitely the toughest one so far. And we are almost out of health, so let's quickly get bandaged. Because even though we just won that, it doesn't mean anything if we don't get back to save. All right, so we've got three health and we are not bleeding. So that just about does it. Uh, Luska the Great, that was a heck of a fight. Um, didn't seem to have any clear place to hide. Um, oh, wow, we were down to our last spear gun arrow too, so that was close. Now. If you have better aim than me, you certainly wouldn't need to burn through 48. But, um, but uh, hey, I'll take it. I'll take the W, even if it's close. So that's going to do it for this video. Uh, what's up next for us now that we've beaten Luska the Great? Uh, you know, we've finished story mode, so we can head back to our main base. Uh, we'll post these trophies up, and we'll craft the rest of our uh, story, the engine and the propeller parts for our escape seaplane and um, stock up on food, water, and gas and we'll take a look at the endgame scenario. That's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please do give me a like. Uh, if you want to hear more and be notified of when new videos come out, please can subscribe to the channel. It is definitely appreciated. And as always, thank you for watching and we'll see you back here soon.